The end of winter is bringing with it some of the best snow of this season, but there's one big problem. Getting to the slopes is getting harder. We have team coverage. Aaron Miofsky is tracking the storm that is hounding mountain roads with snow, as we just showed you. But first, we want to head out to Fox 13's Brisa Mendez. Yeah, she's been catching up with some very excited skiers. This was a major snow day with 10 fresh inches of snow dropped overnight. Skiers and snowboarders by the dozen soon followed. Oh, it's been absolutely amazing today. It's been blower. We got like 10, 15 inches overnight. It's been insane. Uh, the best day of the season, maybe. Luke DeQuetti spent the day making tracks across the resort, starting his runs with a quick safety check. A lot of fun. Deep snow, good tree runs, and, you know, ski patrols doing their, their thing and they're blowing avalanches. It's super safe. Snowboarder Nick Hygerty came in all the way from Boston to take advantage of the conditions here, as his hometown in Massachusetts has seen a mild winter. This morning was just incredible. It was the best snow I've, I've ever been in. Stevens Pass recorded 15 inches of snow in the last 24 hours, but Director of Mountain Operations Vince Arthur says he wants to see more. So the snowpack's a little light. Um, like we average about 450 for a season. We're a little light on that, so we're hoping for the miracle march if it if it happens. But what's good for the resorts may not be so good for the roads. Washdot tells me they are keeping a careful eye on likely avalanche areas. We are out there. We have um, crews around the clock. We have uh, incident response teams uh, patrolling, um, and we just want to work together for everybody to be able to safely get to their uh, destination. Since weather conditions can change hour by hour, WashDAW is advising drivers to download their WashDAW app for its real-time travel map. Reporting in Stevens Pass, Brisa Mendes, Fox 13 News.